47, the Kashmirian is on the move again. He looks to be leaving his apartment, possibly the chawl itself. I... Too many movies, man. You don't know me, but your boss will want to talk to me. By now, he should have found out about the unfortunate fates of Rang Shah. I am the one responsible. Mad? No, no, no. On the contrary, I consider it a successful job interview. Just tell me when to go. Ah, yes, of course. Die, Karin. Live up to the legend. Or die trying. As Karin, I made it. I'm outside the hideout now. Both are taken care of. The money should have been wired to the account already. Spend it as you want, I'm sure. It wasn't about the money. If I'm right about this, about who their boss is, I'll never have to worry about the money again. Well, in a way, the rejection set me free. Big fish lying wait. I'm sure of it. Wish me luck.
all you need. If you want to pass, you need to be frisked first. Is that a problem? Stand still, and it will be over soon. Okay, you're good to go. So, you're one to call. We'll see you. Better make it good. I'll do my very best. Come with me. Delving straight into the heart of darkness, 47. Good luck. Got some balls, man. Killing two of the city's most ruthless people is a job interview. <laughs> That's something else. All right, it's just in here. Good luck. anything dangerous. This will be over in no time. And you're good to go. Time to face the dragon, 47. The mysterious stranger enters the lion's den. I guess you know who I am by now. The Maelstrom. Indeed. Two of my most trusted allies are dead. Childhood friends. Lifelong companions. And now you're here. I always see my contracts through to the end. <laughs> Admirable. Really, it is. I'm assuming Vanya put out the initial contract that drew you here. She never did like Darwin. Power play. Hey, while our plans are in hiatus. But why kill her then? Unless. Unless Darwood made a counter offer. That would be the smart move. But then you heard the rumors about the return of the Maelstrom. And so you took a chance. You figured if Darwood was assassinated, I would put two and two together. Eventually, I would have to teach the Slum Queen a lesson. You took it upon yourself to help me before I asked. A show of skill. A move to get to the top. Is that right, boy? You can only kill so many mobsters before wanting bigger challenges. Darwood and Vanya lost their way once they returned here to Mumbai. I blame myself for their failures. I should not have let them go back without me. They got lost in their egotistical pursuits. Darwood thinking he could use up my legend through his movies. Vanya assuming some mythological regency over the people of the slums. 
They forgot that which mattered the most. What was that? Legacy. In time, you become your actions. Vanya became cruel. Darward became a hollow man. I wonder what we will become. What shape we will take in our final days. Exposed and roar in the eyes of the universe. We can't stay unseen forever. Death comes for us all, my friend. That it does. You are now one of us. You can walk around freely in the crow's nest. We will need to talk again, but not now. The infamous Maelstrom is dead. Very well done, 47. Let's finish this one. Mission completed. Time to find an exit. According to records, this was a youth correctional facility until 1962, when the estate was overtaken by an obscure Soviet research fund, the Institute for Human Betterment. Looks deserted. The place was abandoned after a fire in 89. Then, only a few weeks ago, it was acquired by an anonymous investor using cryptocurrency. It has to be Lucas Gray. He's here. Be careful, 47. The breadcrumbs were almost too easy to follow. It could be a trap. Not a trap. An invitation. You came home. I knew you would. You've come a long way, 47. And even now, you don't remember. This place? This was our prison, where Father trained us, shaped us into killers for Providence. Now, you don't remember, they ripped it out of you, wiped it away, but I do. 
I remember everything. You're a terrorist with nothing to lose. You'd say anything. I know, it's difficult. You never miss your mark or question your function, but we made a pact. You and I. Do this, and we both lose. There was an incident. That boy, he died. He lived. Because of you. Don't you remember his name? You know this. Deep down, you know. What was his name? Subject Six. Your name is Subject Six. And what is our purpose? To take them all down. We were going to tear it all down. The Institute, Providence, everyone who'd ever hurt us. We failed. The partners grew paranoid, made sure that Ortmeier's children would never challenge them again. I'm the only one who got away unchanged. The only one left who remembers. Ortmeier was Providence. Everything he did to us, everything he made us do, it all leads back to them. I'm breaking more rules than I care to count, Mr. Gray. What's your play? The partners hide behind a cloak of anonymity. Only one man knows their true identities. Your client, the top controller, the one they call the Constant. He is the key. <laughs> but he is untraceable. So what am I missing? A man would come to the Institute. A man with a Providence pin. The first constant. If we find him, if he's still alive, he's our way in. You don't know who he is, but 47 does. That's what this reunion is all about. Show them. You're just gonna hand it over. Our one bargaining chip. Olivia. Fine. 47's memory was erased, irreversibly at the time, but... After Ortmeier's death, his estate was acquired by the Ether Corporation. And they made an antidote. It's a long shot, I know. This is not how it works. We don't just join the revolution. ICA is neutral. We don't take sides. I hate to break it to you, lady, but neutrality is a side. It's the side of the status quo. People have died. Civilians. You align yourself with terrorists, murderers. Sometimes even monsters serve a purpose. Look. Enough. You have a choice. But I made mine a long time ago. I will finish what I started. Subject 47, most gifted of all my boys. So you're the pick of the litter. Tell me about the incident. The subject ran away, he and another boy. The instigator was punished accordingly. As were all the neighbors. 
My men did what needed to be done. It won't happen again. Bring your house in order, Doctor. You won't like the alternative. I remember who he is. Gentlemen, let's go over the plan. The first constant is none other than Janus, the legendary Cold War spy master, a KGB senior officer and head of the sixth column special branch at Lubienka. Janus is a certified genius and expert of counterintelligence. He retired from the KGB in 1988 when he fell out of favor with the Kremlin and defected to the US. Shortly after, the Soviet Union collapsed. Now, it is unclear when Janus stepped down as the constant, but since 2004, he has been a resident of a quiet community in suburban Vermont. Mr. Gray. Right, so here's the catch. As an elite KGB agent, Janus was trained to withstand interrogation and torture. No amount of pressure will force him to disclose information he doesn't want to. Instead, we will need to search his home for clues. But if Providence learns of our presence, the game is up. So we frame Janus, make Providence think he was the real Shadow Clan. Correct. I will file a false ICA report, claiming to have traced a number of calls from Janus's house to the Institute in Romania. The case will seem clear. Mr. Gray was only a figurehead. Janus was pulling the strings all along. And by eliminating him, we will have neutralized the militia once and for all. However, for this subterfuge to work, you'll also need to deal with Janus's security detail, a Providence Herald and former Secret Service agent by the name of Nolan Cassidy. Intel describes him as diligent and inquisitive, and we cannot risk that he contradicts our story to his employer. Seems workable. I certainly hope so. Everything depends on this next move, 47. You made this our fight. Now let's even the playing field. Whittleton Creek, Vermont. On the surface, a picture-perfect suburban dream. Wide roads, golden maple trees, and verdant lawns. Most residents here are white-collar professionals, ranging from university staff to government employees. Most, but not all. Janus's unpresuming home is protected by a host of bodyguards, and intel shows that the fragile former constant rarely leaves the property. Nolan Cassidy, on the other hand, roams the neighborhood streets. A recent arrival, the dutiful Providence Herald is busy making threat assessments and settling in with his security team. Now remember, this is about more than just revenge. Janus is the key to bring down Providence. So get in there and find us a lead. Good luck, 47.
47. I've marked your map with several points of interest. We're running this mission with very little upfront intel, but these locations could provide clues to help you obtain the information we need. Good luck. A realtor with a taste for the sweet things in life is in Whittleton Creek to show a house to Nolan Cassidy. It looks like he's stuck at a local muffin stand at the moment. It would be a shame to keep Cassidy waiting, wouldn't it? He's, uh, he's interested in the Schmidt house down the road. You know, the one that Felicia down after the, well, incident. I'm not really from around here, so I don't know anything about that. I see. Well, hmm. Esta mierda keeps happening to me. Oh boy, oh boy, this is bad. God, I feel sick. Hello there. Uh huh. Over the top. I mean, back home, we never went all in, as you say here. It's Christmas. Blake thinks that just because he owns a lot of the land around here, he can box everyone around. We have to go to town meetings every three weeks to do votes on local regulations because he keeps coming up with new ways of trying to control what we can or can't do around here. If that man ever got into higher office, we'd all be living in a police state. No. Don't fly then.
Just hired another guy to give me a comparative market analysis. Sorry. Listen, sir, there's no drama. I just need to check your pockets if you want to pass. This will just take a sec, sir. All right. All right. Good, job, Good job, sir. sir. Thank, Thank you. you. Aren't you looking the good, realtor? man? I've been waiting looking hours good. for you. Mr. Cassidy, I'm sorry for the delay. I'm ready to take you to the house. About time. Let's go. You know which one it is, right? Last one on the right. What sort of secrets she holds? This is the downstairs living room. It is most commonly used for watching television and other recreational purposes. Large room, with two easy to get to exits, dark floors. Hide stains easily. A room with lots of potential. That's all fine. Is there more to this house, though? And here's the basement. The usual boiler elements are to be found down here. And it seems a room with a safe of some sort. Now that is more like it. That looks just like a vault. This, this is very interesting. Any luck yet? Nice work, 47. Let's hope he doesn't set off the alarm somehow. Frank. Go outside and check the garden. I want to know how visible this vault is from the outside. Anything out of the ground, weird sloping things like that. You got it, sir. So you're looking to sell this for, uh, how much was it? Yes, now this is more like it. This I can use. Very nice indeed. All right, let me have a look at this thing. Advanced Kronstadt Matrix Laser Home Security System. <laughs> we used to break these open for training at the academy. The thing about these systems is, most homeowners are lazy, so they don't reset the factory settings and enter their own codes. Let's just try the standard admin code, just for fun. Well, what do you know? It worked. Looks like Schmidt was a bigger amateur than I imagined. So you're looking to sell this for, uh, how much was it again, 1.1? Sounds about right. I suppose that's not unreasonable. And this vault unit looks quite versatile. Internal climate control and explosive laser security. All the comforts of home. Yes, quite interesting. And a nice looking safe in here too. Any idea what the previous owner was using this for? No idea. Maybe a mausoleum. Huh. That's weird. 
But I think I can come up with some good uses for it. All right, I think I've seen enough. No, no, don't turn it down. Good work, 47. Janus awaits your attention.